Hey guys, how many of you have a wooden fence that could use a little cleaning up? There might be mold or algae or dirt or just plain wear and tear and you want to clean it as quickly and as easily and as inexpensively as possible. Well, if that's the case, stick around because that's exactly what we're going to do next on this week's bonus session of Manly Moments. Robbie Sondag here, and today we're going to tackle a long overdue project, cleaning the fence. We've lived in this house for almost 15 years now, and the fence has never been cleaned. Maybe you can relate. Just look at this thing. It's completely dark and weathered. There's all kinds of gunk on it. This fence needs some serious TLC. Now, I don't own a power washer, but I found out there's another way to get the job done. And all we're going to need is a few things. We're going to need a water source and a hose, some old clothes, safety goggles or sunglasses, a brush, a tank sprayer, and a solution. One of the best solutions I've been hearing about is called 30 Seconds Outdoor Cleaner. You can pick this up at most stores, pretty inexpensive. The reason you want to wear old clothes and sunglasses or goggles is because the solution has bleach in it. You don't want to ruin your clothes or you just want to stay protected. Now, I've never done this before and if I can do it, anybody can. Come on, let's give it a shot. Step number one, mix one half cleaner with one half water in the tank sprayer. This tank only holds a gallon, so I'm mixing a half gallon of the cleaner with a half gallon of water. It's pretty simple. Step number two, spray it on. Make sure the surface is dry and you want to saturate it and leave it on if it's a wooden fence for five minutes. If you're cleaning something metal or cloth or plastic or fiberglass, you only need to wait three minutes. For cement, masonry, tile, or asphalt, you should wait 15 minutes. Step number three, rinse thoroughly with a hose and water. No pressure washer needed. I bought this brush just to loosen some of the gunk and the stubborn buildup before I rinse. Probably smart to brush with the grain. It's been about five minutes since I sprayed this. Let's see what happens. Wow, pretty amazing. This thing looks almost like new. If you have a really heavy buildup, a second application may be needed before rinsing. But this is looking pretty amazing. Step number four. Once you're done, rinse any nearby plants or grass with water. 30 seconds outdoor cleaner is supposed to break down when you rinse it into the soil. Step number five. Rinse the tank and store your extra cleaning solution in a cool, dry place. So there you have it, 32 sections of fence. It only took about six hours, about six gallons of this stuff. Pretty big job. And I still have to do the other side of the fence. But that should be a lot easier because there's no cross beams, there's no posts, and it's not nearly as dirty. Now make sure to leave a comment with your thoughts and your suggestions. Some of you are way more experienced at this than I am, and I can learn from you. But overall, I think it looks pretty amazing. In fact, if I can do it, trust me, you can too. And then stay tuned because in a couple weeks, I'm going to post a video of what this fence looks like freshly stained. And the best way to make sure you catch that video is to subscribe to this channel, click the notification bell so you don't miss a single episode of Manly Moments. And we will see you around. <laughs>